What's going on, guys? Ace Dude's Buckeye. Back for another segment of my rivalry series. This time, NC Duke. You guys know, the best college basketball rivalry. It's just that simple, okay? There's no other rivalry in college basketball. You can put above this one. This rivalry is nasty. Remember Tyler Hansborough last year, the bloody nose is dripping everything. Oh, it's just bleeding. It's just bubbling. Classic games, all right? Classic coaches. Just a great rivalry, all right? Great players. Some of the best players come out of these two schools. So let's get down to some facts about the rivalry. They've been battling at least twice a year since 1920. That's at least two times a year. Sometimes they meet uh, in the conference tournament. Possibly conference championship. It depends. So they could play three times a year, and very rarely have they met in the NCAA tournament. Uh, 79% of the ACC regular season titles have gone to either North Carolina or Duke. The Tar Heels lead the overall series 128 to 97. And in terms of national championships, North Carolina has won, count them, five. That's right. Five national titles. The latest being in 2005 when they had Sean May and all them players. Now Duke, uh, they won three titles, okay? The latest back in 01. I think they had Shane Battier back then. I'm not sure. But, so, five national titles compared to three. 79% of the ACC titles. Those are two dominant schools in college basketball. Um, of course, North Carolina went to the Final Four this year. Duke hasn't been in the Final Four in a couple years. They really haven't. But they're still a side team. Um, obviously, J.J. Redick, when he was here a couple years ago, they got Paulus now. Hansburg coming back. Oh, my. That's why I think NC is going to take it. But Lawson and Ellington went. Haven't signed agents yet. We'll see what happens. So, great rivalry. Very fierce. Very competitive. Always fighting for the ACC title. We'll see who wins it this coming year. Holla at your boy, Ace Deuce Buckeye.